anaitwa Kemani Ishungwa Mugeni kia dege Mugeni Mugeni kaeri Goku weta goku kia nikia dege si ha dege Nesi goka Vara ya dho dekuo Na mukipata tivet Sindio Najua mweshimu ya rais Mimi nimejua kumbe huyu mwiti Sio mwiti mjeuri Wale watu wa jeuri zaidi ni hawa watu wa kenike ya dege Hawa ndiyo anatuma mwiti aja ya kusumbue Lakini venya nimeona hawa watu wa kombele Rais kubali huyu mweshimu ya mwiti Aendele kusumbua wewe Sikete ya state house ifungulue mwiti ya kija na ingia tu Anaitisha tivet Anasema ikoji kue upgraded Na unajua mimi nimeona nyinyi ni watu wa maana Sababu umemweza kumsikiza rais Mkasikia ako na mipango the biti ya ajira ya vijana Na nyinyi mkaelewa ili vijana wapate ajira kwa housing Lazima wapitie kwa TVET Sindio? Nyinyi munaelewa kabisa, sindio? Na mumemuelewa huyu rais Ako na mpango waka Na alituambia kazi ni Wira ni Ati tukasema harambe Yudie Kazi ni kazi, sindio? Ndiyo mezema mweti aingie Yudie Sindio? Kawira mama muangaza aingie Ati munazema kawira haenda wapi Na mweti haenda wapi Na nyinyi muko hapi? Yudie. Rais hako hapi? Yudie. Rikiji hako hapi? Yudie. Sisi woto hapi? Yudie. Situko hapo? Yeah. Kwa kazi ni kazi. Yeah. Ndiyo maana unaona sisi saingine tunakorofishana na wala wako kotini. Sababu rais ametuambia mepanga kazi ya vijana. Na anasema anapanga kazi ya vijana sababu wanaelewa Kenya hii Hakuna shida kubwa kuliko shida ya ajira kwa vijana. Lakini wale wako kotini. Sasa wamepanga ati mpango ya housing isimamishwe. Vijana watu waende tivet alafu warudi wakai nyumbani. Mutakubali hiyo? Na tukiwaambia wafisadi. Wale wakora. Wale watu ya state capture. Makatels. Wote wamejazana mahakamani. Wanasema zijui tunahujumu uhuru wa mahakama. Your Excellency, I want to plead with you. The conversation that you began at the beginning of this year, a conversation about job creation, a conversation about corruption and the running of cartels in the judiciary and all arms of government, that conversation, Your Excellency, must and should continue. Raisa Endele as Yendele. Endele as Yendele. Housing Yendele ama Isimame. Housing yendele? Yeah. Mambo ya TVET yendele? Yeah. Mambo ya online jobs yendele? Yeah. Tumetoka mitungu, tumepata kijana hapo, ametuambia muwezi moja, 30 days, akifanya kazi masama wili kwa siku, anapata $520. Hiyo ni elfu the manini na tano pesa ya Kenya. Na anapata akiwa hapo 2 hours. Mimi mbunge, kupata hiyo pesa, nafunga tae, Na vaa suit, naenda kufanya kazi karibu wiki mzima ni pata 80,000. Uyu mweti kupata 80,000, lazi maende mkutano ya komitii kama ishirini. Ili alipu elfu nne, mara ishiri, na kila mkutano ni mazama wili. Kijana akiwa mitungu, two hours, anatengeneza pesa mingi kuliko mju, mjumbe. Sindiyo, tunataka tive tapa? Ili ikuwe mpaka na online jobs. Lakini sasa mtu wakitenda wili. Simunajua ule mtu wakitenda wili? Sinirafiki ya rais? Sinirafiki ya rais? Anaambia rais ati asipeleke watoto wetu wafanya kazi ngambo. Wale wamefanya kwa TVET, wamefanya mechanical engineering, rais amepanga na watu ya Mercedes, Germany, hawa mechanics watoke hapa TVET, hapa kwetu, hapa kieniki ya dege, waende ujerumani. Mutu ya kitenda wili anasema rais asitafutie vijana kazi nje.
Rais akitafuta ile online kijana afanye akiwa kwa Tivet hapa mtu akitenda wili anasema hiyo Tivet atapeleka kotini. Rais akiweka housing wameshikana wamepeleka kotini isimamishwe. Mnataka isimamishwe ama iendelee? Na wale wako kotini tuwaambie vile rais umesema. Please those of us serving in the judiciary just like those who are serving in the executive and those of us who serve in the legislature we have a cardinal responsibility to ensure that we take care of the youth of our country through job creation what we are seeing today your excellency has nothing to do with the independence of the judiciary what we are witnessing today is judicial overreach they have overreached their mandate they are now sabotaging the work of the executive sabotaging the work of the legislature and above all sabotaging the jobs created for the millions of youth in our country your excellency i want to plead with you don't allow your government to be sabotaged or to be undermined by cartels and masters of state capture either through the judiciary or even in the legislature kangumu rais awakalia mazi wakalie hata hao majaja wakalie ngumu na mimi rais najua ulifanya mkutano na hiyo watu na tunakuheshimu nimekutolea kofia ya rais na ulisema utawaongezea pesa kwa judiciary lakini kama unataka uongezee pesa na hiyo pesa itakuja kufanyiwa budget kwa bunge na mahali pesa inatoka ni kwa ushuru na hii judiciary ndio inasimamisha ushuru yako mimi naona hapo kama tutakosana kidogo. Mimi naona kama ikifika bunge tutafunga funga kingine. Tuwafungie tusiwafungie. Eh? Tuwafungie ama tuwape? Tuwape sababu ya rais. Ama tuwakazie. Vile wanakazia si wanakazia vijana wasipate kazi. Na wanakataza ushuru isukusanywe vijana wasipate kazi. Na judge mwenye anafanya hivyo mshahara yake ni nyinyi mnalipa na taxes zenyu si ndio wakaliwa ngumu asikaliwe sasa mheshimiwa rais ukiona bunge imeweka pia kazi yao ya kufanya budget making in line with the priorities of the people of Kenya please allow us your excellency hata sisi tupige msasa budget ya nchi yote tuangalie kama judiciary wanapata pesa hiyo pesa inafanya nini kuchangia ajira ya vijana wa Kenya? Executive wakipata pesa wanafanya nini kuchangia ajira ya vijana wake? Hata ya bunge hiyo mwetia anapata. Si anasema within five months atakuwa na uh, ICT hubs. Pesa akipata ichangie kwa ajira ya vijana. Adwake ndiki adake. Tureshoka ndiki. Tue UDA ibiwe. Moga mwetia ikara UDA. Mama Kavera yu? Ateona mburu? Mburu ule wa nope u? Ahige nope u? Mburu umezgia nope u? Wanainji wamefunga. Mumefunga nope u? Mume wind up? Mume ipeleka receivership? Mburu waingia wapi? Kwa hivyo mburu? Mweti? Mama Kavera? Sisi wote? Apple.